Boom. So what we got? Mince meat. Get me beef, lean mince, proper things. Some spring onions to go through that. We've got the brioche baps. I told you, brioche is the way forward. Trust me. Put like, I'll stress it. Like normal white bread, normal brown bread. I hear that. Whole grain, wherever you eat gluten free, I hear that. But you see brioche, nothing can test. Trust me. Coleslaw gang, I see you. We've got some cheese. And man's gonna, man's gonna add something else as well. You get me? Yeah, man's gonna add something, but man will let you know. Boom. So yeah, man, what are we on? Home, homemade burgers and that. Hold on there. When I say last week, make sure you don't wash your hands, you know. I don't want to see no tramping thing, fam. Wash them hands. I am a rock and come in. Hear me? Trust me. Trust me. Hot soapy water with that. Hold tight, the brother that, that clocked the, the fairy as a hand wash, but it does the job, you get me? So, yeah, now we got our meat in there. Um, now you can just go with the seasonings and that, you get me? I want to. Um, on everything, you get me. That's on everything. So. All seasoning, all, all purpose, all, all purpose seasoning. We're gonna hit them with this. Trust me, proper things. You get me. Jerk seasoning, jerk seasoning. Get me, might catch a. Get me a little spice, but it's all good. What else you got in there? No, no. We can just run this one again, still, just to give it that kick again. You get me, and then yeah, man. Put a spring onion through there for texture. And yeah, man, you can season salt as well, but you don't want them to be too intense. You get me, cause when you eat a burger, yeah, you want to taste everything in that burger. You get me, so the flavour just needs to be right. You get me, so don't go mad with the seasonings and that. Just take it easy. You know what I mean? So boom, go with the all-purpose first dish. And when you season it, yeah, because there's a lot, yeah, because it seems like a lot of meat, yeah. When you rub it in, it might not look like. It's seasoned in it, but just trust me, just do 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 well on your judgment, yeah. Boom. Dry piece of that off, I mean a really dry piece of damn. You know, just it needs to go quite fast too, so. I don't know how, I don't know, like, I see a couple of people talking about they chopped off their fingers. Like, that's I don't, their business. I don't know, I see, yeah, that's your business. I don't know how your knife skills are going, but if you're down with this, trust me, get busy. Tr please, please, please be careful, but trust me, learn this, trust me, it's sick. If your fingers get chopped off, put it in the fridge, freezer in them. Like, yeah, or uh, you put, put it, it in, in the ice straight away. In the freezer, yeah, and get to the hospital. But these are touching my eyes, I ain't gonna lie, cuz. In there. Get me, you don't need to put too many things through the um the, the mint man because like you're gonna put other things in the burger that you wanna taste in it. Yeah. That's a lot, you know. Bro, I didn't even know it was gonna be that much. I ain't gonna lie. I might hit this up with a bit more seasoning. It don't look seasoned, but it's seasoned, you know. I'm gonna drop this. I'm gonna drop this salt in there. Um, little see, little salt and that, just a little push. Zimmy, Zimmy, in there. So boom, that's your mince there, you get me? Now, what also I'm gonna do as well, yeah? Let that do its thing in it, because of like I said, let that soak in, yeah? We'll shake them in a bit. Yeah, man, so wedges. Like you can do any shape really, I just keep it normal, keep it wedge in it, like just think wedge in it. Just think wedge, like shoot my drive, but I've gotta get my knives from work. Can someone <laughs> remind me to get my knives from work please so I can chop properly? I know I see my dish in my peppers, I see you as well. Yeah, I don't think I ain't missed nothing in it. I see everyone, blood. I see my this in my peppers because it worked cut properly in that. But look at what man's working with in it. Just bear with me. Someone remind me to get my knife from work and I'll be good, man. The wedges, they call it blanching. It's called blanching. But 
yeah, you just cook it like halfway and then you might use another method to finish it. You get me? We're gonna blanch these in this water and then we're gonna bang them in the oven. Two tablespoons of that. Uh, two teaspoons of that. And two teaspoons of that. Yeah, that's it, yeah. And you're rolling and you're calm. And no, I don't put no salt because you're cooking them in salted water. You know what I mean? Again, be easy with these things, car. The salt content is high. Yeah, man. Hold on, let me check this oil. We're getting too hot. Keep an eye, always keep an eye on what you're doing, man. Trust me, be so bad that things go down in the kitchen. Man. Things do go down in the kitchen. So, yeah, obviously, the potatoes are cooked back to a certain extent. So, you can just do something soft in it. You want something soft that's not going to mash them up in it, like something really soft. You get me? Get all that seasoning there. Like that's blessed. What's that? What's that called? Spatula? That's a Maris. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do with me. Just like one by one, slowly. You don't want the oil splashing. So it's in there. You just fry them up, you get me? They're all in there frying up. Make sure. The reason why you keep high temperature is like, if you cook them too slow, they'll just go mushy. You need to cook them fast, in it? So oil's hot. Everything's hot. Oven's hot. But again, guys, just pay attention. You know? I don't want no one to turn like bun down the yard. So boom, like that's a decent sized burger to me, innit? Once you cook that, it's gonna lose a little bit of weight, but it's nice size, you get me? Boom. And you just start to shape your burgers, innit? Like, again, if you're with 10 virgins, you probably have to, you probably need more mints or just have really small burgers. But if you're with like four or five virgins, Trust me, you can get good sized burgers, blood. Trust me. You just shake them, you get me? Make them nice, fam. A little bit of smoke is cool, but again, be careful. Burger in there. Get me, burger in there. Get me, get me. The bomb man, don't move them too much in it. And if you've got a non-stick Teflon pan, use that as well. Don't move them too much. Get me. So now, I'll still a bit soft. Let that do this thing. So now, again guys, be careful that like, I'm not responsible for your burns, innit? That's a big burger, you know? That's a big burger, fam. Like, that is a hefty burger, blood. Like, trust me, if you're not about that eating big food life, make them smaller. And I've, I've got seven, like, you get me? So that's a lot. You get me? Not gonna pattern that down a bit, pattern that down. This one, I have to be careful. Give me the whip of the wrist. Yeah, I, I can't believe burgers, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, bro, they're too, they're too fragile, bro. Look at this. Adding that. That's called basting, you get me? That I can whip, 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 whip. Get me? That's called basting, isn't it? Basting the ting. Basting the ting. Basting the ting. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. Old type big nasty. We're basting the ting. You get me? They, they try to call it basting, but it's not. It's F basting, you get me? It's basting. Basting, you get me? Look at that. Boom. Nice stuff. That's just adding the flavour back into it, man. Yeah, it's always going to run back out. Right? So right now, boom. Burgers are sealed on both sides. If I can try and lift it up and let you see it from the other side, can you can see that under there. Yeah, they're sealed. Sealed. Can you just lift them up onto there. Get me. That's that. You get me. And then hot oven. Obviously, you got your chips in there or your wedges in there anyway. Just chuck that in. Hot oven. If you do it too, if you do it on a low oven, they're gonna stew and like all the water is gonna come out and they're gonna be sloppy and not nice in it. So make sure hot oven get me keep that temperature up. Hot pan, bang, cold pan. You know I mean? 
So yeah, man. So that's in there. That's in there. You got all these burgers left. I don't know what you want to do with them, but again, trust me. You make it work. You get me. Make, make that money stretch. You get me. Get me. So yeah, what we're gonna do? Brioche buns. Yeah, nice. Proper things, guys. If you haven't tried brioche, these are a bit dead in it. You can get better ones, <laughs> but trust me, brioche is the one still. So what you're gonna do? And again, like brioche is high in sugar content in it, so make sure you turn your toaster down in it so you don't burn them in it. You want a light toast car. They burn quick. Let's let that simmer. Quick check. Bam, check them wedges, G. Get me, proper teams. They're done. We ain't got to trouble them again. No, we ain't got to trouble them again. Boom. The burger. See that all of that, that fat that's come out, like so that's just so like look how much they've shrunk. You get me? Compared to when I first like yeah. you get me, there's still all that fat come out in it. But what you do, what I do, this is for the one. Which one you want, Lord? Ever one. Yeah, you sure? The one about the egg for. Yeah, 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 yeah. cool. So then put that in there. And then you just put that on top there. Like that. Trust me, fam. That's all there, ready for you. Start putting the chips on, bro. And crispy potatoes, bro. Mm, it's gonna be spicy, you know. But it's cool anyway. If you're not a spicy lover, you can do like herb and that. You can get like dried herbs and use that. If you're just like, and that and lemon or something. If you're not a spice lover, that's cool. I, I'm not a massive. Last person, but I thought just drag it up today, innit? Just for today. Boom, check the brioche. Look, that's ready. That, that was a setup. You get me? That was a setup. So boom, man's got the brioche buns. Quick like this, watch it. Boom, blue cloth with my spatula. With the spatula. One with cheese. I mean, egg, one with that uh, egg, one with egg. You want coleslaw, fam? Yes, please. So, look. Get me, coleslaw gang. Hold tight, Auntie Val, this is not hers this week, sorry guys, but I had to use something in it. Hold tight, Auntie Val. But, coleslaw gang, each and every, coleslaw and everything. You feel me? And then, boom, give it a little press so you don't want it toppling over. That there, boom, that's you fam, get me, bang, bearing in mind, yeah, you still got seven more, you got six, sorry, five more of burgers uncooked, again, you can do anything with that, you know me, you'll probably see that later on, yeah, boom, that's you fam, didn't take that long, again, if your burgers are smaller, they'll cook quicker, you get me, you can use your, like, if you can shallow fry your chips, that's up to you, you get me, like, but well, that didn't take that long, what was that, about 25 minutes, half hour, that's just, man, them eating again, you get me, fresh, proper food, you know what's in there, you get me, none of that funny stuff, man, touching up your food, like, you know what's in there, you know, it's clean, it's cool, it's washed, you get me, and then boom, whipping in the kitchen, got two, got two, what are you saying? Eat good, live good, you get me? See man getting off the bus in stony jeans and eating shit food. <laughs> Trust me. Get me? Crispy skin as well, it's crispy, you know? I'm like, oh dude, no, no man, king of the kitchen. King of the kitchen, man, hashtag, you get me? Hashtag whipping in the kitchen. Get me, RD underscore music updates. Get me, keep sending in your requests there. Trust me, I ain't, I ain't forgot no one. You get me, trust me, I see everything in it. So just keep sending in your, your requests and whatnot. And man, man, we'll get it whipping, you get me. Man, we'll get it cracking, man, we'll get it whipping, you get me. And type Lordy, Ground Report TV. Ultra, I do, man. Trust, trust me. me.